Well, the final day of meteorological winter is going to be a cold one tomorrow. We're going to find temperatures tonight dropping through the teens, heading down to 10 degrees at 11 o'clock as those skies clear out. And then tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock, 6 degrees expected. Overnight lows between about 0 and 5 above. We'll be around 20 at noon with mostly sunny skies and then some increase in clouds late day as we get back to partly cloudy conditions at 5 o'clock. Time lapse over in Preble County. You can see just a, a few fair weather cumulus clouds floating through the sky as the sun heads towards the horizon and we are not going to be looking at those clouds along around the area for very long tonight as uh, dry weather and high pressures building in should bring us those clear conditions and allow for those frigid overnight temperatures live Doppler 2 HD it's dry today or at least now around the Dayton area but we have been tracking a few lake effect snow showers coming off of Lake Michigan swinging through northeast Indiana and into the northern sections of even our viewing area we've had a couple of flurries today but even those uh, looks like those bands will be breaking up tonight as the winds become a little bit more variable and eventually turn around to the east and northeast for later tonight and into tomorrow morning. Right now we're at 20 degrees. Wind north northwest at 13. That's giving us a wind chill factor at 7 and the barometric pressure is on the rise. Now it was only in the teens up north today where we saw a little bit more cloud cover. Right now 12 degrees in Bell Fountain. You've had some snow showers today. Even down into Miami County and over towards Springfield. Not much in the way of any snow south of Interstate 70 and and as you can see, those temperatures tonight into the lower end of the 20s where we've seen a little bit more sunshine. Looking off to the northwest, Fort Wayne at 11, 11 degrees at Mansfield. Look at the wind still out of the north northwest at about 10 to 15 miles an hour, keeping those wind chill numbers down into the single digit values for us and even some sub zero uh, numbers over the northern part of our viewing area up into Mercer and Auglaize counties. Our future track forecast tonight stays generally clear. Any clouds around this evening will quickly be dissipating, leaving us with those clear skies, allowing for those frigid overnight temperatures, but then plenty of sunshine is expected as we go through the day tomorrow. It will be cold, though. Uh, we will see some of those high, thin clouds start to move into the area tomorrow afternoon, and then they'll start to thicken up heading into tomorrow evening. Eventually, a little bit of snow could be headed our way past midnight tomorrow night, but right now, looks like any accumulations will be on the light side, more than likely under an inch. Skies clearing out tonight. Very cold. will drop down to 4 degrees, and northwest winds now will Diminish and turn around to the northeast at 5 to 10 miles an hour. Mostly sunny skies tomorrow. Another cold day, but with that late winter sun should boost us up close to 30 by the end of the day. Clouds will start to increase later in the afternoon. And here's your hour by hour forecast. Sunshine through the morning, 14 degrees at 10 o'clock, 20 at noon, and then back to partly cloudy skies tomorrow evening, 27 at 7 o'clock. Your Storm Team 2 seven day forecast. That chance for a little bit of light snow early in the day on Saturday. And that may even change over to a few sprinkles before ending. And then we'll even climb up into the 40s, but then turning colder Sunday and into Monday. A wintry mix, snow, sleep, freezing, rain around the area Sunday, changing back over to all snow by Monday.